One new addition to 3D Coast Retop of Workspace is the Sharp Edges tool. It allows the user to select edges or edge loops in order to mark them as sharp, to which 3D Coat will split the normals during the baking process. So let me demonstrate. I'll first hide some of these other objects in the scene. Okay, and I'm going to hide these other two parts here. All right. As you can see, I have relatively sharp edges on this model, so I can hold down the shift key to select entire edge loops, and you'll see that it marks them as purple or a dark pink. I can single click to select an edge, or again, hold down the shift key to select entire contiguous edge loops. Another way that we can approach this is to use the select tool in edges mode we can have 3D Coat select everything that's sharp by using Select Sharp. In this dialog, as I begin to drag this slider, I'll see a preview. If I like what I have, then I can hit OK. Now, once all those edges are selected, I can choose Mark as Sharp. I don't see anything, but once I hit Escape to drop that selection, you'll notice that the selected edges are now highlighted in purple. I should also point out that if you want these to be used for your UV seams, you can go back to select sharp and select edges marked as sharp. I'll hit OK. Now I can choose set seams. Once I hit escape, I'll now see that these edges are no longer purple, but they're white. White tells you that you have both UVs and hard edges selected. And that's going to conclude this look at the Sharp Edges tool in 3D Coats Retopo Workspace. Thank you for watching. We'll see you next time.